<sighs> oh, hello, boys and girls, moms, dads, grandmas, grandpas, cats, dogs, and all you peanut butter sandwiches. It's Teacher Sweaty here. And today, it is too hot. If only there was some way that we could cool down on days like this. Actually, there is. If we want to stay cool, we can drink a lot of water. Ah, we can eat an ice cream. We can even stand in front of the air conditioner. Ah. We could even put ice over our head. Ah. Refreshing. We can even have a water fight. But what if there was a more convenient machine we could use to stay cool whenever we wanted. Wait a second. Do you feel hot and sweaty on those long summer days? Well, worry no more because all your problems can be solved by this amazing new invention, the fan. Have you ever felt that you would enjoy the sensation of air moving at incredibly high speeds all over your face. Well, the fan has you covered. Just turn it on and adjust the speed settings to get the airflow you need. Whoa, it's like a typhoon. And what's more amazing than the cool, cool air you'll be feeling is the low, low price you'll be spending. This fan can be yours for the low price of $999.99. Yes, you heard that right. $999.99. Get yours today. That sounds perfect. I need a fan. But $999? Oh, let me see. I guess I can't afford it. I know, I can make my own Lego fan. Let's go! If I want to make a fan, I'm going to need to be able to turn it very fast. To do that, I can use gears. Gears are a great way to change the speed of our machines. Look here, if I turn the yellow gear, which is big, it will turn the blue gear fast. But if I turn the red gear, which is small, it will turn the yellow gear slow. We can change the speed of our machines with gear. Okay, I've got together all the pieces I think I need to make my fan. I've got a big yellow gear and a small blue gear. Remember, that is going to make the fan turn very fast. I also have this big propeller. This is going to move the air forward. Do you want to see how to make it? Okay, let's go. First of all, we take our green plate. We're gonna lay down a base in the center of our plate and start building up. Our fan needs to be a little bit high so that it doesn't hit the ground. I'm gonna go up a little bit taller using this yellow brick here, and then one more green brick. Then I place my long red brick on top. That is going to be the base for our fan. Next, I take my small blue gear and I'm going to push it in the center pole, right in the middle. I hold it in place with two yellow wheels. One, two, great. Now, I'm going to put my fan's propeller on. So I take one handle, put it in place, and then put the propeller on. If I turn it now, it will just fall off. So we need a second handle, 
which is going to hold it into position. Great. But right now, I cannot turn it very fast. I need the power of gears. Let's take a gray axle, and we're going to put it into hole number two, just like that. On one side, we will put a yellow wheel to hold it in place. On the other side, we are going to put our big yellow gear. Great. Then I will place another yellow wheel, and finally, a handle. Finished! Ayo. Finished! Ah, so cool. So... Finished! Now all I need to do is turn the handle and we will have cool air for sure. Wow, look how fast it's turning. We did it! Now you guys all know how to make your very own Lego fan. Let's see if you can make one at home and stay cool all summer. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye bye! Bye bye.